Welcome to iLecture Online. Now let's find out what the numerical solutions look like when we try to find the potential or the voltage due to a point charge nearby. We have two examples, one with a positive charge, one with a negative charge, so you can simply see how in one case we'll get a positive potential, in the other case we're going to get a negative potential. These are simple examples, but it always helps to see what an example looks like. So we know that the potential is defined as K times the charge that causes the potential divided by the distance away from that charge. So in this case, that would be 9 times 10 to the 9th newtons meter squared per uh, coulomb squared. That's for the constant K times Q. That's going to be 6 microcoulombs. That's 10 to the minus 6 coulombs, all divided by the distance, which in this case would be 2 meters. So with a calculator, let's find out what that's equal to. So we get 9e to the 9th times 6e to the 6 minus divided by 2. And that gives us 27,000. The units will be Newton meters per coulomb. And we know that Newton meters is joules, so joules per coulomb, which is volts. So this becomes 27,000 volts. Again, notice that the, that the symbol for potential is the same as the symbol for its actual unit, so don't get confused there. Here, we use the same equation that the potential V is equal to K times Q over the distance R. So again, that's going to be 9 times 10 to the 9 Newton meter squared per coulomb squared. Multiply times the charge, which in this case is a minus 4 times 10 to the minus 6 coulombs all divided by, and let's put a line there so we don't get confused, all divided by distance of 2 meters, which V is going to be equal to, and let's see here, that's divide by 6 times 4, that would be 18,000, but in this case, since we have a negative there, it'll be a negative 18,000 volts. So notice that when we have a positive charge, we have a positive potential or voltage. When we have a negative charge, we have a negative potential or voltage. And that's how it's done.